guys and welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm doing a thrift haul. This is stuff like not all from one thrift trip. Um, I've kind of accumulated it but it is all fairly recent. So I'm gonna try to like I'm gonna try to do this by category of like type of clothing item but ooh, it's high. There we go. Get some of that nice sub-zero air in. I'm gonna start with like sweater type things. Um, this isn't really a sweater, but I got this flannel. What's the best way to hold it? Um, it's Ralph Lauren. It is double XL, so it's ridiculously large, but I love it for that reason because I can layer it with other stuff and I never really just wear it as a shirt. I kind of wear it as like um, just an extra layer or a tie it around my waist. It's 100% cotton and it is very soft and it's kind of these boring like colors but um, it's pretty neutral so it goes with pretty much everything. Next is this sweater. Um, my sister called me um, or FaceTimed me so I'm filming this on my phone so I got interrupted. I think I was saying that um, I like this sweater because it reminds me of Tommy Hilfiger and with the v-neck and the stripes and it's like this cute knitted sweater. Last sweater I think is just this black turtleneck. It doesn't look very good right here but you can see in um, when I'm trying it on. Um, just super basic. It's super thick. I think this one is cotton too. It feels like cotton. It's 65 percent cotton and 35 percent viscose viscosity viscose I don't know okay um viscose is not a natural material um but it's mostly cotton and I just liked it because it's super basic and it's warm and it goes with everything so obviously it is getting colder so I've been wearing a lot more pants and stuff rather than shorts these ones I really like you can see the pattern. Um, they're, I'm not really a fan of like the waist cause it doesn't have a zipper or buttons or anything. It's just like stretchy, um, but they do fit me really well. Um, they are plaid, but they're like just black so they can still go with like pretty much anything. Okay, another pair of plaid pants. These ones, I like the like fit of them a lot better. They just have like normal zipper and stuff. I just like these ones better because they're like high waisted. Um, so I think they're like kind of more flattering. Um, anyways, these are Bill Blass jeans, 100% cotton, super high waisted, just classic kind of light wash denim, really good find, just like vintage mom jeans. But my other pair of jeans that I got are these. Oh, I love these. You can just tell that they're really high quality. Again, 100% cotton, so they're like that nice, like not stretchy, like really thick. Denim. What I love about these is they're lined with this flannel and they're lined all the way the whole pant. You can feel such a difference when you wear these. First of all, it's so soft against your legs. Second of all, like it just adds so much warmth. So in Boone, it gets really cold. I'm excited to have these this winter. I guess this kind of went with like sweaters. I kind of forgot about this. I just got this hoodie that says Truckee, California. Um, I've never actually been there. It's just like a nice oversized soft gray hoodie. And I think the I think the um, design is really cute and just like colorful. Super comfy. T-shirts, I guess now. Um, kind of random selection here. But this one is just a Polo Ralph Lauren t-shirt. Um, has this like cute kind of like faded design. Um, again, 100% cotton, super soft, and like oversized, it's just cute with like jeans. This one is kind of weird. This is like a grandma, it's like literally from probably the 80s. I tucked this into high-waisted jeans once and literally looked like a mom about to go gardening. I just couldn't resist. It says sweet pea and it has like just this little design, lavender bees, and I love it. This t-shirt is like one of my favorite things I've ever found at Goodwill. It's just this like vintage white t-shirt. This is Grand Canyon National Park. Um, it even has some holes in it and stuff. I don't care because I don't, I don't know. It's just the perfect size. It's really comfy and just the graphics. I've never even been to Grand Canyon, but a white t-shirt goes with everything. Okay, another white t-shirt, this one's long sleeve. It's just a David Bowie shirt. Um, I think it's like kind of a cool, cool colors and cool graphic. And it's like um, from his tour and it's comfy and cute. 
and maybe I'll listen to more of his music soon. Okay, this is like my other favorite shirt besides the Grand Canyon one. Probably more than the Grand Canyon one because I used to live in Alaska um, in Juneau and it's like my favorite place in the world. It's the most beautiful place in the world. So I just found this shirt that says Alaska Grizzly, which is like so random because like it doesn't even say like Alaska or Juneau, Alaska or like a, a place. It just says Alaska Grizzly. But I think it's like so ridiculous, but so funny and I love it because it's from Alaska and I love it because it's white. This jacket. This is like my favorite jacket. I walked into this Goodwill and it was the first thing I saw and I was like, all right, I need that. So it's this bomber jacket. It says Murray, like whoever used to wear this. And it has this like funny little motorcycle and it has this like faux fur, but it's just like, it's so warm. I'm not kidding. It's warmer than my North Face coat, which cost me like a hundred dollars. Best thing ever. Last but not least, my coffee's cold. I have bought like cheap belts before. It's just like not worth it because they fall apart. Like if you wear a belt every day, it just like falls apart after a while if it's not real leather. Real leather things are expensive and I can't really afford that. So I've been like so lucky to actually find these belts at Goodwills and stuff. Um, This one, okay, it doesn't say genuine leather on it, but it feels like genuine leather and it looks like genuine leather. Um, Either way, it was like a dollar. So it's just this little through here. Um, and it just like has a buckle like that, which I think is like really cute and really simple. Let me see. I think this one's not real leather. Nope. Okay. It is genuine leather. Um, this one's more like, like a statement, I guess. It just has this really pretty buckle and like these cool little things. It's just kind of hard actually to like get these through your belt loops. So it's kind of a pain in the ass, but um, it is really cute. All right, and then the last one, my absolute favorite. Real leather, um, this like Western. Look how pretty that is. It has this like cool kind of like bumpy pattern on the leather. You can feel the quality really well. It's definitely my favorite belt. I wear it all the time. I think that is all for today. Thanks for watching and if you want, you should give this video a big ol' thumbs up, as the YouTubers say. Um, subscribe to my channel, and I guess that's it. Ugh, I don't know how to end these. I'm so bad at it. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.